Now's the time for the master. <laughs> Hey everybody, this is Mike and Connor with SkylanderNuts.com. We're here today to take another look at another Skylanders Trap Team villain. Today we're going to review Shrednaw. We're going to take a look at his quest and show you his attacks. Hey Connor, guess what? The la Who was the last villain we, we just reviewed? Bombshell. Bombshell. And you remember where Bombshell's quest was? At the beginning of the level. At the beginning of level 9, Mystic Mill. Well, I... Guess what? We're back at the beginning of level 9 Mystic Mill, but this time we're not going to do Bombshell's quest. Today we're here with Shrednaw, and his quest is almost right next to Bombshell's. Yeah. All right, you ready to get in there? Uh-huh. All right, let's get in here. We just did the um we just did the ship part to this level, the beginning puzzle piece and the shooting piece. And you can see the captain there with the quest over his head. That is Bombshell's quest, but we're not going to do his. We're going to walk straight forward there and see that building. We're going to go in there and we're going to get to Shrednaught's quest. It's two of maybe the easiest quests in the level I think you can get to. Let's talk to him. Yep. I was supposed to be the foreman of this mill, but those Evilla can barricaded me out of my own office. Only thing that can cut through this enchanted wood is one of those giant shreddnaught machines. You don't happen to have a spare one just lying around somewhere, do you? Well, we sure do have one spare laying around. We got one in the strap right here. You ready, buddy? Yep. Let's load them up. Oh, yeah. Shred. Yep. All right. You trolls can't build anything worth a lick, but you sure know your chainsaws, don't you? She's a real beaut. And if you'll be so kind as to saw down this barricade behind me, I'd be much obliged. Holy two by fours! You cut through that wood like a hot knife through butter. Oh, which reminds me, I left a bagel in my office. I'll be getting back to that now and have a nice little reward for you, too. Alright, so that's all you gotta do to be evolved. Now, what are we gonna turn? Like, black? What Team happened? We saw. You got a little bit of. I don't know if you changed Zebra color. color. Yeah, you got some, like, uh, enhancements or something. Maybe some more <gasps> spikes. Insert I don't know. Disc. Uh, but you know that wood that we just cut? Mm -hmm. this wood too. Well, that but that's not the one that was a barrier, right? It looked like a gate that we just that he just cut open. Mm -hmm. Now, anywhere on this level, and maybe in other levels, but at least in this level, that's a sign that you need to switch to shred knot to cut that gate open in order to access hidden areas. Uh, that that's how you can get the rest of the hats and stuff. Hey, and if you already had involved shred knot, and you were in this level. Okay, I'm going to this quest. Oh, I already did this quest. Oh, but now I can open the box and get money. Yeah, yeah, you can get... You, if you oh, already had right evolved there. them, you could come do it again and get... You can go in there and get the money. What do you got? What do we got in there for for uh, treasure? That's the money and all these things I get with money. Yeah, a little bit. Not too much. N nothing major. Sometimes you get a hat. I want to see if there's anything over here. I don't think there was anything. Nah, it won't in there. allow me like a visible. Right. I I don't think there was anything else in there first time we went through here. But you know, sometimes they give you a hat or a trinket when you do a quest. I don't know. Sometimes they just show up, but not in this one. All right, buddy. Well, let's switch to shred knot and uh, ready to use his main attack here. His main attack is called the giant chainsaw. So if you press the X button, what happens? Oh, he's already in a fight. So it goes around one time. Now that he is upgraded and evolved, it says you can hold the attack one to charge the chainsaw to run longer and do more damage. So, like, if I hold down the X button, this will If you hold it down, it goes what? Super fast and then it'll spin twice. So it spins twice instead of once. Okay, that's pretty cool. We'll go ahead and try. Oh my gosh, look at his active time. His active time is super fast. It is going down very fast. His, uh, he does a little bit of damage too by not even not spinning it. 
Let's exit right here. We'll see some more. Let's hold it down. Ooh. I didn't even get a chance to do my attack. <laughs> they that just kill. ran into you and they got they got killed. Well, it's funny. Some took two damage, which is like nothing, and some took 110. Well, so maybe while you're charging it, it does more damage. Yeah. Yeah. Because otherwise, it probably does very little damage. All right, you got anybody else coming up here? Because your time is almost up. I'll just sweat. I do. Oh, well, you do have more guys, so. I'll just show in the next attack. All right, hit the B button. What's okay. the B button do? All right, Listen, that is the called. The guy jumps out and booms. Yup, that is called backseat driver blast. All right, now you might want to switch off him and get that guy above you or something. What's go. in that? Oh, he goes. You need to go under the bridge. After I get. This. Oh, there's an enemy is. So enemy, the back street, enemy. the backseat driver blast does more damage now that he's evolved. So what do you want to do? Backseat driver blast? Yeah. You're also doing bonus damage for uh. I'll just do this. Yeah, that's the easiest one, isn't it? It doesn't do a whole lot of damage either one, 110 and 146. Why don't I charge it up on these next enemies? Ah, uh, I think now you got a lot of puzzles though. Yeah, I'll go do the first one. I'll tell you what. Maybe okay. we'll skip forward. We'll do these puzzles. We'll come back in a second. We'll just do the magic of editing and come back for another battle. Yeah. All right, here come some more enemies, I think. Yeah, there you go. All right, switch back to Shinnok. There you go. Now, you, which attack are you going to use now? Do you backfire, because for these okay. chompies, they're going to be easy. And no matter what you do, it's easy for those guys. Okay, now it's time. Just tread some superpower. Well, he's doing a pretty good job. Those shields aren't holding anything against the uh, saw there. Alright, buddy. Well, so what do you think of Shred Knot? Oh, pretty you can go up there and get some good. more. Let's go get some more bad guys. You want to try out some more of the attacks? Yeah. Let's just These guys come out for a while, right? Yeah, you got the saw, out. they do about 60 to 110. And you got backseat driver, yeah. which kills maybe about two of them at a time. How far does it work? Uh, pretty, pretty close by. How did it do more damage? Like... Here comes some more. Ooh, yeah, backfire seat. It's not backfire seat, it's backseat driver. Oh. That's okay. Backfire, that's something that somebody else does. When Skylanders does that. There you go. Why couldn't Shred not just cut that? I wonder. Seems like the same beat. Alright, buddy. Well, that looks like all the enemies coming for a while. What do you think of Shred not? Um, pretty good. Pretty good? I better switch out. Yeah, you can switch out. He's, I'll take him out of the traps so he doesn't interrupt. interrupt. So, do you think he's better than most of the other villains we played with, or maybe not so much? Not so much. I not so much. Say. He's not bad. I don't think he's bad. That saw is kind of cool to use. But his active time, he does not stay active very long, does he? No. No, we've seen some other guys stay active much longer. Um, so he's not going to help you take a lot of damage while, you're, while you get through a hard part or something like that. Um, but he's not, he's gonna, you can run into people and just get that, uh, chainsaw going with the X button and do a good amount of damage to the guys around you. Um, not too bad. I think there are some better Skylanders like Chopper. Yeah, or Chopper. Not Chopper. Uh, Buzzerbeak. Oh yeah, Buzzerbeak. He's kind of like Chopper. But he does that little, that, his helicopter thing, just 400 damage to everybody around him, so... Uh, -huh. uh, I think there are better enemies, and, and this guy, we picked him up in level 4, and it's now level 9, so it's been a long time since, I, I even forgot we caught this guy. So, you know, he's easy to forget, and, uh, he might be worth a play or two, but I don't yeah. think I'd keep him nearby. I think you got some Chef Pepper Jack and some other villains that can do a whole lot more damage quicker. Uh, he's also pretty slow. Yeah. Wasn't he? Yeah. So, all right, well, visit us at SkylanderNuts.com, and we'll have a written review for Shred Knot, and we'll have a score. Uh, you can see how he compares overall to some of the other villains that we've reviewed, and, uh, you know, tell us what you think about him in the comments, I guess. See, maybe yeah. we missed something about him. Maybe uh, maybe there's a good way to use him that, that uh, works a lot for you guys, so let us know. Until then, uh, we'll be back with another 
Trap Team Villain Review soon. This is uh, Mike and Connor with SkylanderNest.com. Hope you're having a good time playing Trap Team, and we'll see you soon. Bye.